Yeah, Robin Karen, and tonight the federal government says it's looking into all of these problems. Behind me is the rebooking line here at Midway for Southwest. At one point, the wait to get to the counter, five and a half hours. And in many cases, the next available flight is days away. Tonight, this sea of unclaimed baggage, a sign of the chaos plaguing Southwest Airlines. I would just say I'm frustrated. Like, how could you not see this happening or how could have they prepared better for it? The Cormax of Naperville missing a cruise after their Southwest flight to Florida was canceled. The next available three days away. We now have going to have to pay for our hotel because you had to cancel that as of yesterday. We can't make that. The Southwest rebooking line of five and a half hour wait. Tara Anderson and her family stranded here since yesterday, unable to connect to their destination and unable to go back home to the East Coast. So my daughter lives in the St. Louis area. She's in school, so she's coming to pick us up and we're just gonna drive all the way to Virginia tomorrow. All this the result of bad weather wreaking havoc with Southwest's point to point network of flights, unique among major airlines. Southwest problem really is the uh, system is out of kilter and the snowstorm is moving and they just haven't been able to reset the operation. Southwest in a statement saying our heartfelt apologies for this are just beginning. We anticipate additional changes with an already reduced level of flights as we approach the coming New Year holiday travel period. Adding to frustrations, many passengers whose flights were canceled now can't get their bags back. Even though we're not going to Fort Lauderdale, our bags will apparently. Then they have to turn around and come back and eventually they will tell us when our bags are back here. We cannot get it back. It doesn't matter if you tell them I have medication in the bag. I'm not even flying Southwest anymore. You don't get it back. Today, Southwest canceled 70% of its flights nationwide. Already tomorrow, 60% are canceled, and it could be days before the airline is back on track. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.